everyone, today's video is going to be my highlighting routine type of video. Usually by the end of my whole entire makeup, I have everything on. Now, the last thing I did before I set everything with my e.l.f. Makeup Mist to Set Spray. This is the setting spray that I use um, when I set all of my makeup. I have to highlight. And the highlighter that I've been using, if you guys will follow me for quite a while, I've been using the Wet n Wild Fergie highlighter and I got it at Ross this is their central stage highlighter and oh my gosh when I said when I first looked at it it reminded me of MAC Cosmetics and just look how gorgeous this is I think I did a separate video of my favorite highlighters but I haven't actually did a video on my highlighting routine so you have and this is the brush that I use it's a sibling brush from Coastal Seeds to highlight I already have on blush. My blush is from Wet n Wild. It's Heather Silk, which looks like this. This is a blush that I wear pretty much in my videos and also every day. So this is what the blush looks like. Rosy, gorgeous type of blush. So, um, yeah, so this is basically what I do every, every day like every day if I'm wearing makeup to work or if I'm just going out on the weekend or if I'm just going to church I cannot complete my makeup look without a highlighter so this is what it looks again up close it has your shades of a, um, a main white glow highlight then it has the bronze color sections to choose from this can be great for women of color also because it's not really you know that type of highlighter that oh it won't show but it will show on any skin tone because you got some highlighters that certain highlighters for fair skin they have certain highlighters for um lighter sisters if you about my complexion a little bit lighter than me but this one is definitely a, a highlighter for everybody and it's affordable i paid six bucks for this this is more um expensive inexpensive than the hard candy and tiki i used to use it all the time i stopped for a while i need to go back and purchase that i know i paid like ten dollars for it but this is like a lot more inexpensive so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my highlighting routine let's get ready to beat that face with some highlighter because i got the head on out the door taking the coastal scents brush this is their sibling brush and i'm going to start out with the bronzer golden shades a little bit first and what i usually do is i top off major excess i do the fish face and like how i'm contouring i just go over my highlighter with the contour that i applied it earlier so we can get more like a gradient effect so sorry for the luck i'm trying to kiss you guys i'm not i'm just doing the perfect steps but i go over it on both sides with the brush I have a big bump there excuse the bump then I take the lighter part and I just definitely apply it to my chin area it just wakens up the face a lot too then my cupid's bow is just a little triangle above your lip and then I'm going to take it down to the bridge of my nose and then I'm also going to definitely apply it to the little little itty bitty part of my nose to the temples and I kind of contour even more with highlighting too as well I don't know why I just do then I do it on both sides, down to my jawline. You know, you gotta add a little bit of highlighter to your jaw, up under the eyes. This was this step is just amazing, and then also my forehead. But this is the look now. I love this look. This look is amazing. I love the highlighter. Just guys, just observe how gorgeous and natural this highlighter is. It's not too over the top. It doesn't take away the makeup. It's just amazing. Ignore the pimple or whatever it is. But uh, this is what it looks like. And to complete everything, I am going to use my Makeup Mist and Set Spray. And I like to shake it up. So you guys always shake up Makeup Mist and Set Spray. No matter where it comes from, whatever the company is, always shake it up. It's very important to do that. And once you shake it, I just lean back a little bit and also I just spray it onto the face. Just do a couple of sprays. Sometimes
sometimes I over spray, but I'm gonna play on being out for a really long time and spray. And that is it. That's everything I would do. I will airbrush or fan my face with my hand a little bit so that everything can absorb. And that's basically my highlighting routine. When it comes down to highlighting, and if you guys see that gorgeous glow on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, which we link below, make sure you thumbs it up or press it here in the center or you know, put my name right here. Um, you guys, this highlighter is amazing! Oh my gosh, it's amazing! I highly recommend you go get this highlighter, it's just awesome to choose from, and it looks like it gave you so much product to wear probably can wear it for a really long time you guys know those highlighters where they just give you a little bit and then you get pain and you gotta re get it uh-uh this thing <laughs> you're gonna last and it's a great highlighter to have in your starter kit I think I mentioned this in my starter kit video um, about highlighters and stuff and I think that was one of them that I mentioned. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Um, don't forget to thumbs up, rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. And don't forget to check out my other videos that I have recently posted. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.